Hey, what's up guys? Now if you're a gamer, you've probably considered upgrading your monitor to get a high resolution like 1440p, maybe even 4K coming up because obviously you get a high resolution, the game's gonna look better, right? There's actually another type of monitor that you might wanna consider and that's a higher refresh rate monitor. They have 120 hertz and 144 hertz monitors as opposed to the normal 60. So you might be thinking, wait a minute, now should I get a higher resolution or higher refresh rate monitor? Because usually they don't go hand in hand. If you double your refresh rate, it's gonna take twice the processing power of your computer, just as it would take twice the processing power if you doubled the resolution. So which one do you go with? Because typically if you wanna get a 144 hertz monitor, it's probably gonna be 1080p unless you wanna spend a ton of money. So should you get a 1440p or 144 hertz? Now this is going to be really preference. I've used both 1440p monitors, that's 2560 by 1440, and I also have a 144 hertz monitor. Honestly, I think I prefer a 144 hertz monitor. If you've never used one, you really wouldn't understand that it's just so much smoother. If your graphics card is powerful enough to get a game up to 144 hertz, if it's not like too graphic intensive like Counter-Strike or something like that, then it is so much better to play on a higher refresh rate. And honestly, I'm not too concerned with graphics on a game that I like to play somewhat competitively, not just for graphics. Now, if you're playing single player games that are really like beautiful landscapes and that kind of thing, then maybe you do want a high resolution monitor because surely that would look better. But I definitely think you should consider getting a higher refresh rate monitor instead of just into the, going into the camp that, oh, high resolution is better in every case. If you ever have the chance to check out a 144 hertz monitor or 120, I definitely recommend checking it out because you will immediately notice the difference. And going back to 60 hertz, I can tell you it is painful going back because it's just so much smoother. When I got my 144 hertz monitor, I immediately noticed the difference even on desktop in Windows. Moving the mouse around was so much smoother that I immediately went, whoa, this is so much smoother than 60 hertz. And people who say you can't notice the difference or the eye only allows 30 FPS, that is BS. You can absolutely tell the difference. It is so much smoother. Now if you've got enough coin, there are actually options which allow both. Asus recently released a monitor, it's $1,000, but it has 1440p and 144 hertz. Now, that would be ideal, that's amazing. That's best of both worlds, and I'm sure eventually we're gonna get monitors that are like that within reasonable prices. But until then, you probably have to make a distinction. Also keep in mind, running a monitor that is both 1440p and 144 hertz is gonna take a ton of processing power you'd probably need SLI or two-way SLI or three-way SLI even to handle that kind of power unless you're running at a lower resolution or running the monitor at a lower frame rate. Now, if you're really not willing to upgrade your GPU and your games are only running at maybe 30 frames a second or something like that, it's probably not gonna be worth it to get a 144 hertz monitor because if your graphics card can't get that kind of frame rate on your games, then it's not going to make a difference at all. You're not going to notice a difference because it's not going up that high. But if you're playing a lot of games that have 144 hertz plus frame rate, then I would definitely get a 144 hertz monitor because it is way nicer to play games when it's a lot smoother. Honestly, I'm not even that more concerned about graphics nowadays. I'm not that concerned, oh, the graphics are so good in this game. That's that's really not what I look for, but honestly, it's preference anyway, so you might consider that a big deal. So I want to know what you guys think. Do you prefer a smoother game or a better looking game? Let me know in the comments. I want to hear what you guys have to say. I already kind of told you my opinions, but I want to hear what you had to say. So also, don't forget to like the video and subscribe. Try to make new videos all the time, so, so don't want to miss out on that. And thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.